you want better relationships, don't you? Or at least you want the relationships you have to work better for you. Hey, I'm Rosemary Nani Knight. I am the Prosperity Minister. I support driven spiritual people to regain their confidence and to leave behind the pain, the limiting stories of the past and rise victorious in their true design life. I do believe we all get to live free, fulfilled, financially abundant, love-drenched lives. And I also believe that we're here to make a difference. We spiritual people really need to rise up to get beyond our, our fears and our self-doubt and step into the role that we're here on this planet to play, to, to make the difference that we want to make. Our relationships play a huge part in that. Our relationships make or break us. I spend so much time when, with the clients, with my clients, um, talking about relationships because sometimes it's not about the work that you're doing or not doing. It's about the fact that you're distracted by painful relationships, by longing for loving relationships, by, you know, relationships, my goodness, people, people, <laughs> people can be so much fun or they can be hell. <laughs> but this is the thing you've, you've kind of, you've kind of lost the confidence to believe that you can have better re relationships. Maybe you never even had it. Because you were brought up thinking that you had to put up with whatever anybody around you decided to bring into your life. Yeah, you argue about things, maybe even try to have talks with them about things. But when it comes down to it, it's almost like you're, you, 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 you just put a, a facade on and pretend to be happy enough to get on with doing life with the people around you. Um, and, and most of them don't really know you anymore, but there's a deep longing inside of you to have deep communion with like-minded souls who get you, who you can be yourself with. But there's a part of you that doesn't believe it's even possible anymore. You have your family and they are what they are. You have your friends, they are what they are. You have your colleagues at work maybe and they are what they are. And you tell yourself, I have no... Ch what? You don't even tell yourself that, you just put up with it. You just put up with it as though there's no choice. But there is choice. There are seven point God knows what billion people on the planet. There is choice. There's a heck of a lot of choice. But you're not, it's almost like you're not courageous enough to step into all of that choice. But you're not thinking about it that way. I get it. You think you're being good. You think you're being kind. You think you're being, um, you know, a nice person, a nice spiritual person by putting up with nonsense that you don't have to put up with. There is always a way to elevate into a more powerful relationship. Always. There's always a way to get what you desire out of relationships, but it takes courage. It takes confidence. And that sometimes is what you're lacking at the moment. Not because it's not there within you. You are a very powerful person. Absolutely. It's because it's layered by years of being, years of ignoring yourself, years of just putting up with whatever shows up. And so all courage and confidence has just been pushed down. <laughs> And all that seems to remain is, well, I just have to live with whatever. It's all right for other people, not so much for me. But I'm saying to you, honey, you can have relationships that work for you. You can have relationships that empower you. You can have intimate relationships with, you know, a an intimate relationship with someone who adores you. You can have friendly relationships. And, and even with your work, you can be in an environment that supports you. You can share your heart, trusting that it will be kept safe. Not, tr not, not knowing that if you share your heart, someone's going to use it against you in some way. It doesn't have to be that way. It doesn't have to be that way. But it does take you getting very deliberate about designing your life differently. That's one big, huge reason why I've created the, the incubator, the Deliberate Millionaires Incubator. It's a place to come and find like-minded people. It's a place to come and connect, commune heart to heart with other people who get you. Okay. Because we're all on the same path to peace and plenty. We're all on the same path of wanting to really learn to love ourselves and to step in, in confidence out into the world to make the difference that we're here to make and to create the prosperity that we want for ourselves and for our families. We're all on the same path in the incubator. 
You come in because you know you're that driven, determined, spiritual person who is done with settling for less than what you are capable of. Come and do life with me. Come and take part in the Empower experience and be empowered. Come and communicate with other like-minded people. Come and check in with me. Let me speak directly to you about what is going on with you and how you what are your next steps. Come and immerse yourself in the Abundance Library with all the programs and the boot camps. Use it, journal around it, listen to the programs. Let them elevate you. Let them empower you. Let them strengthen you for the life that you desire. You are a spirit-driven soul here with a purpose. No longer can you allow weird relationships, painful relationships to stifle you and pull you down. You deserve to be loved. You deserve to be empowered in, your, in, in each interaction that you have with people. Yes, it's going to take some doing to get to that place where that is your life. But if you don't start somewhere, you'll never get there. So start today. Come into the incubator. Come and be empowered. Come and be strengthened. Come and remember who you are. It's rosemarynonnynight.com forward slash deliberate millionaire. Go right now. Take a look. See what's on offer. Join in. Or just join in, honey. <laughs> I've already told you what's on offer. Join in. Okay? You know, you've been, you've been in this community for a little while now. Come deeper into the inner circle. Come and see what is possible for you as you get very deliberate about the design of your life. Come on in. I look forward to doing life with you. Do share this video with someone else as well. It's time. Much amazing love.